Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Bioshock Infinite. In this episode, we are going to go up there <laughs> to the Hall of Heroes so that we can get the, uh, the Shock Jockey. Uh, and then eventually, I don't know if yet, you can see it from here. Uh, we need to get to the First Lady's Aerodrome, uh, which we need the Shock Jockey for, and get the gun. There's a lot of stuff. The gondolas, uh, the gondolas around here are just always breaking. It's, it's absolutely ridiculous. Not not very well maintained. I think we have to probably make a jump here. Yep. Fantastic. I don't know why this skyhook gives me like. I don't know why. Oh. I don't know why this skyhook kind of gives me like magical jumping ability. It's pretty nuts. Uh, there is some bad stuff going on around here. Mm-hmm. Oh, RPG. I hate to get rid of this, like, special gun, but I'm gonna get the RPG because, uh, it's, well, it's an RPG. Veterans! You shed your heart's blood for Colombia! Lost limb and viscera in the godless Orient! Comstock did nothing! And yet, look up! Whose image squats above you even now? At every angle and insult! If the Prophet would make a painted whore of our past, what fresh rape does our future hold? Let us now make our stand and fill yonder hole with true heroes! Uh, take this rifle. Ammo, take it! Oh, take a sniper rifle? Is there anybody to snipe? I'm not seeing anybody. Find that shot. All right, this rifle's cool. <laughs> no scope. Oh, dude, how did you? Ah, crap. Not good. <laughs> Dang it, I panicked. I really panicked there. I should have I should have meleeed, but that's fine. Whatever. I forgot. Uh That's fine. It's fine. All right, who is still shooting around here? All right, can you wait to shoot at me until I'm looking in your general direction, please? There it is. Oh, what is, wait. Oh, that's uh, one of the giant soldiers, okay. Interesting. Oh, and then there's a uh, another, like, shock jockey station over here, too, that we can unlock stuff. Got it, we gotta remember to do that. What's up, Crows, how's it going? Appreciate all your help. Oh, what's going over here? I don't have a lot of coins, because I just spent money on, like, gun upgrades and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, I only have 81, uh, Silvered Eagles. This place is huge, though. Huh. 
ominous music going on here. Not sure I like it. Oh, let's watch the, uh, watch the thing. Oh, well, there you go. Just electricity wherever you need it, I guess. Thanks, Mr. Fink. All right, we're going in. So it's like, is sleep? Man, all right, there we go. Man's always been half a fool, half a hero. Never could tell which side was more dangerous. Is he like our, is he our enemy or, I don't know. Too rare is the man who takes a stand for God and sweetest fatherland. But here's the place where we revere the heroes of our city fear. Hmm. I have a feeling that there's going to be some sort of boss battle with Slate at some point. Yeah, they're, they're loading us up right now, huh? Oh, yeah, okay, so that's my question from uh, the last episode, or the two episodes ago, where I was wondering if you could backtrack and buy the stuff that you weren't able to buy. Looks like that might actually be the case. Hang on. Let's go this way first. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay, so hopefully this, hopefully that stuff, like, doesn't go away and it kind of backslogs so I can buy all the upgrades at some point. They'll call us assassins when our work is done. Cornelius Slate, the swift left hook of the Vox Populi. <laughs> we'll be trading Comstock's life for a new one. So be it. The Fitzroy woman and I are comrades of necessity. I doubt all the men who read in Caesar's toga would still be seen breaking bread together in peacetime. With Comstock gone, my men's past deeds will be sacred, and they will claim the spoils due them. I need not live to see it. I'm not sure why the, like, people just randomly show up. Don't like it. Now right, let's go in here. Father Comstock, commander of the 7th Cavalry. That man did not lead the 7th. Hell, I don't even remember the guy. Corporal DeWitt proved his worth on the field that day. Well, I'll be. Slate? Is that you? You've always been different, haven't you, Booker? You crave no glory. Look, I see you're caught up in some kind of jam here. If you could see fit to let us through to where they keep the shock jockey, and we'll that tin soldier, Comstock, wants my boys dead. We won't die at his hands. There's going to be trouble. All my men have left is a choice. Die at the hands of a tin soldier, or a real one! Uh, oh. All right, come on, Slate. You see? You see, you're a killer, Booker. Like it or not. Just give us the shock jockey. If you want the vigor, Booker, you will give my men a soldier's death. They wait for you with wounded knee and baby. What? All right, dude, you've gone nuts, man. Come on. Is this the, uh... Cornelius Slate, Soldier of the Orient, and they destroy his statue. I wonder if... Huh. I'll just go ahead and turn that off. No reason to leave it on.
Uh, anything? Oh, there is like a... Oh, the Fink Industries, like, shock jockey stations or whatever. Here we go. Now we're talking. Alright. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go for the shield. I gotta go for the shield. Why... Already. Why go for the... Why go for health when you can do the shield, which recharges? I wanna... I guess the health might... Might give you, like, more more like bar than the shield or whatever but the shield recharges so might as well go for the the shield is my uh my reasoning i'll try to keep you stocked with both bandages and ammo but the right materials aren't always at hand yeah i appreciate that thank you oh swinging chandelier sure defeat slate's men Boxer Rebellion and the Battle of Wounded Knee. All right, Slate. Uh, the Boxer Rebellion. What Trying to this? kill me. It's the Boxer Rebellion. What happened there? In Peking. It was my hand that put the city to the torch. Of course, that's not how Comstock tells it. Look, man, just let me... <laughs> They're trying to kill me. Oh, the head? Oh, man. Kind of, that's pretty brutal. Let's go into the employees only. Oh, red paint? Okay, what is that? Enemies become easier to melee execute. Alright, we'll just take that one. I feel like the, ge the gear in here hasn't really been all that exciting. At least I haven't been excited about it. Very upset that that doesn't make a bell sound. Whoa! Jeez! Elizabeth, you could've, like, helped me out there. Why are they all attacking this door? Was yellow skin and slanted eyes that did betray us with their lies until they crossed the righteous path of our prophets, holy wrath. Alrighty. Jeez, look how big this place. This is, this is kind of cool. If they had like some sort of display on this, oh, I read about this. I would absolutely go there. Led the Colombian troops to Peking. Was it there? The boxers took my eye and thirty of my friends. Is there even a stone to mark that sacrifice? Ow, ow, ow. Watch out, fireman. Thank you. Yep, give it. Appreciate Thank you. We did it. You see, young miss, you see the man that Comstock wishes he was. A real I soldier. I don't want to do this, Slade. Just give me what I need. I will, after you do the same for me. Come and look for me amongst the ghost dancers. Who are the ghost dancers? Wounded knee. He means us to head to the other display. Can you hear Comstock's tin soldiers coming to silence us? But we are the true patriots. The history that does not fit in their books. Alright. Uh, well, anyway, guys. I think that's where I'm going to leave things off. 
Uh, I don't know why there's just a pile of burning books over here. It's kind of interesting. Uh, but yeah, I think that's where I'm going to leave things off, guys. Uh, in the next episode, we will head over to Wounding Knee. Uh, hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode. If you guys did, uh, please leave a like and a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed already. I do put out daily gaming videos, so be sure that so you don't miss anything. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.